what is up guys it's Brigamatic back again with another review or well, more of a unboxing this time today I have four Harry Potter packets of the minifigures for you so let's go straight into it so first up if I can get this open we have Dumbledore nice so, I'll give you a look at the pamphlet first. So, there is a look at the pamphlet. My favourites from the series would probably have to be Cedric, Harry Potter, Dumbledore, Malfoy. I don't know like all of them. Um, yeah, I like all of them top pick for the series would have to be maybe Professor Flitwick or Draco Malfoy just because I really like that outfit for him so let's build up Dumbledore um, just an old base this time so yeah let's build him up um, he has a beard And he has that nice plate from the Order of the Phoenix, I think it is. This is his outfit from the later movies. So, yeah. Um, he also comes with this new, or new for me, colour of wand. Which I won't give him just yet, just because it's going to take a while. Putting everyone's wands on them. Well, he sports in the new dress piece, the gown piece, I could say. Nice painting on the front. Hat and beard are different. Hat has a little fez. Nice wavy hair. Only one expression. Um, and that's what he looks like without his beard. And his torso print is just like that. It looks like Cinderella. Pretty insulting, but so yeah. Okay, well, I guess we'll move on to the next packet. Look at that one. Just because I don't want to really put on all the stuff just yet. Let's see who we have next. They didn't cut anything. Oh, and we have Tina Goldstein. It looks like. Once again, I'm not going to bother with the ones Move her into the spotlight a bit though. So she uses you for a, I'll show you her off. Her, she uses the new blue or coat, double molded boot, which is really nice. Um, which she, yeah. I can find her head. Hang on. Ah, there it is. Two head pieces. She has a rather grumpy one and also a more chipper one. And this is the same head from the Lego Dimensions. And she does use a new hat colour, which is more accurate to the movie. And she comes with this hot dog. And the bun is in a darker nougat, which is much more accurate. Just to compare these other two Tinas, this one's definitely more accurate, as you can see. This one's still cool, though. Next packet. I was hoping to get Harry Potter figures over Fantastic Beasts, but that is fine. Who do we have it next? Ooh! Professor Flitwick. That is awesome. Um, he's got this. Oh, put him over here so that he can watch. So you can get a better view on him. Tina also comes with this. The standard brand colour of 
the wand. Same with Professor Flitwick. So I suppose I'm gonna have a lot of wands at the end of this set series and minifigure packet series. Has this new um, megaphone, which is a nice little Easter egg or reference. That's a way around. And he also uses this nice new headpiece. So that's what. Oh, sorry. Oh, there we go. There is Professor Flitwick. Okay, and final packet for today. Sorry about these conditions for. Oh, there's not much room, but hopefully. In the final packet for today, who will it be? Ooh, Mad Eye Moody or Barney Crash Jr. So he has. Different coloured double bottom boots, one for his prosthetic leg and one for his normal one. Um, he has some nice shirt printing and back printing. It comes with the dark colour ones. And you can have again Body Crunch Jr., which just looks like that. Or you can get that I'm rooting, which looks like that. So yeah, this is probably one of my favourite figures. Um, yeah, no, it's two figures in one, not only, but it has one of my the lesser known characters. Got that nice reference. Body Crouch Junior is one of the. One of my favourite lesser known characters of the Harry Potter series. And he has that Polyjuice potion, which is basically Maraca in a new different one, which is very nice as well. So, next time, guys, I'll be reviewing the Brother Right Takedown, which is pretty cool. So, yep, um, and. Um, Harry Potter sets, I am having no luck finding, they are sold out everywhere I've been, so look forward to the Lego, new Lego Batman Brother I Take Down, and Harry Potter sets will be as quick as I can get them out. On the other hand, the Grindelwald's Escape might be the one, the next review besides after the Brother I Take Down. The next Harry Potter themed review will be most likely Grindelwald escape, otherwise it will be the Quidditch match. If the Quidditch, if I can't find the Quidditch match or a Whomping Willow, it'll be a fantastic reset. So thank you guys for watching. Like and subscribe. It is free, so you know, why not? And yeah. See you guys next time where we will be reviewing the Brother I Takedown. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next time.